Hi, thanks for joining me for this week's video. It is an empties review. Stuff that I have used up and I'm about ready to toss out, but I wanted to share with you what's been rocking my world for the past couple of months. Most of these products, I'm already on the second and the third one, so uh, you're about to see how much I'm loving what's going on here. Many of these got me through the summer months and a lot of them continue on in different ways and I'm excited to share with you how all of that works. But as you can clearly see on this table, there are a lot of products to talk about, a lot of things that have made me really, really happy. So I want to share those with you. And it runs the gamut from house fragrance to body fragrance to makeup to skin care to hair care to you name it. So anyway, let's get started. I've got my glasses because a lot of this stuff I'm going to need to read for you. And I'm going to start with fragrance first of all. And what you're about to discover is that I am a vanilla slash coconut addict. Okay, anywhere I can get that fragrance either on me or around me, I'm trying to do because it just reminds me of a beach and that's where my head wants to be all the time. So my personal favorite fragrance actually comes in two different scents, but it's by Comptoir Sud Pacifique. This one is called Coco Extreme and they also have a fragrance called Vanille Coco, which is a combination of vanilla slash coconut. Oh my goodness, it's incredible. Anyway, I usually buy that one. I bought the Coco Extreme just to try something different. And so what I find that I'm doing is now combining coconut and vanilla. <laughs> so you may as well get them together if they make you as happy as they make me. But the smell of this is just incredible. Anytime I walk into a room, someone says, have you been baking something? You smell like a vanilla cake. Thank you very much. <laughs> I love it. So to continue uh -oh. that theme of smelling good, I have this reed diffuser that I found and this one is by Nest and the odor that comes from here is truly heavenly. It's been sitting up here for the past couple of hours and now this room smells magnificent. So it's by Nest and it is a combination of vanilla orchid and almond. Again, another baked good right here. I keep this baby in my bathroom. I'm about ready to buy a few more and just stick them all around the house because it is just one of those reed diffusers that actually lifts and comes out. Sometimes you smell the reeds and they smell fantastic. You put it in a room and you just can't smell it. It's not coming through. This one does and the fragrance is absolutely beautiful. And the price point, you know, on these things, not bad either. I mean, some of these can go up to, you know, a hundred plus bucks and I'm not going there. So everything here is priced very, very well. So as we continue the trend of smelling good, but now we're going to feel good at the same time. This is a body butter that I had been using all summer long and I love how emollient it is, how it feels on my skin, but again, I love the smell. It's Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Body Butter with Gluten-Free Vitamin E Firming and Toning. This spa-inspired body butter melts in so quickly to nourish firm and tone skin. It's got coconut oil, hibiscus flour. It just smells good. It feels good and my skin has been happy all summer and has been glowing glowing because of this that I bought at my local drugstore. How do you beat that? Okay, so this next one, um, my hairdresser, Emil, shared with me a while ago, and it's by a company I had never heard of before. It's called um, Alpha Parf Milano Semi Dilino uh, for all hair types, Crist Cristalli Spray. So it's basically an illuminating finish, and it adds a tremendous amount of shine to the hair. And as you know, there are a lot of um, spray products out there that add shine, but sometimes I find that they make hair really greasy. So I just sort of spray this right around my ends and perimeter where it is a little bit fried and frazzled, especially from being at the beach and in the water and having highlights and all of that. And so if you're trying to let some length grow into your hair and you want um, it to look healthy and shiny, this is amazing. And it, it smells good and it works well and it doesn't weigh the hair down. And I just, I've been loving this. So thank you, Emil, for turning me on to this. It's been super fantastic. 
Okay, uh, speaking of hair, as you know, this summer I wore mine curly a lot. I let a lot of the natural wave come through, especially after, after I did the Brazilian Express treatments because what I shared with you is it doesn't make your hair board straight, but it does take away that outer layer of frizz and kink. And so I was able to let the natural wave come through. And what I used on top of that was this product. This is by Diva Curl, super cream, coconut curl style. <laughs> Are you detecting a theme here? I thought so. Uh, define and control. This is a cream. It's sulfate free, paraben silicone free. By the way, most of these products are, so I'm happy to pass that along. This is great because you can use it one of two ways. You can either put it in wet hair after you've showered and let your hair air dry, or after your hair has dried and if you feel there's a little bit of frizz in it and you want to tame it, you just put a little bit of the Diva Curl in your hand, you rub it together, and you distribute it through your curls. And it really kind of locks them in, tightens them up, gets rid of that outer layer of frizz. So that has made my curls happy during the summer months and it got rid of the frizz, which makes me unhappy. Moving on to hair products, this is going to come as no surprise, but this is probably my 89th bottle of Kenra Volume 25 Super Hold Hairspray. I just love this stuff. It works for me. It's a brushable Super Hold Hairspray, which is such a rare combination because usually if it's Super Hold, it means it's super tacky and you can't get a brush through it and your hair feels dirty. Not with this, which is why I'm still a loyal fan. Now, this one is going to answer a question that many of you have had, and, and I've had a lot of inquiries about deodorant, especially um, paraben-free, hypoallergenic, and without all the chemicals that are in deodorants, and I found one by Naturally Fresh. It's a deodorant crystal, and this one is Tropical Breeze Scent. <laughs> hence taking me back to the beach where I just feel I need to be. Uh, but this has no aluminum chlorohydrate and aluminum is of course the product that many of you are concerned about in deodorants. And so uh, I love this one. You know, oftentimes if it doesn't have aluminum, it doesn't work as well. And I have tried a lot of different aluminum free deodorants and I find this one to be the best and it also smells the best. So that is a major winner. Next up would be my toothpaste and if you just saw my teeth whitening video you know I'm using this toothpaste by Hello Fluoride Free Whitening Toothpaste Natural Sweet Mint tastes like a Tic Tac so much so I am I am out and so I need to buy more Hello. Hello. Okay this one you may find interesting I discovered this through my chiropractor and Dr. Deloche told me about this pain relieving cream that has menthol. It's a topical analgesic. It's called Relief by Corganics and it has 3% menthol in it. And what I love about this is A, not only does it work to ease muscle tension, especially in the neck and shoulders where I feel it, but the smell, I can't get over. I can't get over how good it smells. I, I just love it. And I find that most of these creams are so off-putting because of the smell, but this one makes me happy. It smells good. Granted, it doesn't smell like vanilla coconut. It, it smells like, it smells like peppermint, but it's wonderful. So it, this stuff helps me and, uh, and I enjoy, I kind of sniff my shoulders as it's on. So that's great. Another product that I have absolutely loved this summer is by Saint Tropez. It's called One Night Only Gloss. And it's a finishing gloss with a high shine. And you put this on your legs, on your arms. Now granted, I know we're going into winter months so we won't be showing as much skin. But even if you have a cocktail party to go to and you're in a dress and you still wanna have a bare leg, but you don't want that leg to look white, you want it to have a little bit of a tan glow, this thing is magic. It's got a great gold glitter to it, but not too much. Super, super rich in emollient, so your skin is gonna feel ultra moisturized and it's gonna have that sun-kissed glow. So this got me through summer and it's going to get me through any gala or evening event where I'm going to show a little calf. Okay, moving on to the back row here. And this I love as well. Now, we all have makeup brushes that need cleaning. And so a question often comes about what makeup brush wash do you use? And my friend Gentry Kelly, uh, who has a cosmetic and skincare line here, has a 
a hydrating brush cleaner that she sells and it's true what I find is with some brush cleaners it'll clean your brush but the bristles start to feel a little bit dry and ratty but this one I, she must put some oils in there and all kinds of good stuff because it really conditions the bristles of these brushes and the hair and it just feels soft and great so I know my brushes are getting clean but they also feel good they feel good against my skin and I truly believe it preserves them and makes them last longer so as you can see I am empty of my brush cleaner. Um, I'm also running out of this product and this is by 100% Pure. I've mentioned this before on my channel. It's a uh, coffee bean caffeine eye cream helps with dark circles and puffiness it's 100 percent natural so i'm all about caffeine either in me or on me working its magic and it does in every single way so if i wake up in the morning and i got myself some bags that i'm not happy with i just slather this stuff on drink my coffee and before you know it everything is where it should be um, now we are moving on to a couple of lipsticks. No surprise here. I am completely out of my Lipstick Queen Nude Metal. It's just one of my great go-to lipsticks and what I love, and I have another one I'm going to share with you in just a moment, but what I love about this is it's, it's a beautiful peachy gold um, shimmer, but it's sort of a matte finish. It's a standalone lipstick, but I also will put this on top of something a little bit deeper and darker to lighten it a little bit or to give a 3D effect by putting it just a little bit here in the center of the lower lip and above. So this is a lipstick you can layer and it's a lipstick you can wear on its own. I have, I've been talking about this baby for years. I'm out again because I use it so much. Now this next one that I'm going to share is full because I just bought it because I was out and this is already my third tube of this Marc Jacobs in the mood and it's their cream gel lipstick again I just I just love peachy nudie neutral colors they just work with my skin type this is a solid it's a creamy finish a beautiful peachy nude again as a standalone or to lighten up a dark color I'm, I'm all about layering lipsticks to get the right shade to go with whatever palette you have going on to go with whatever your skin tone is depending where you are in a season this is a very light colored lipstick it's very creamy it feels good on the lip and um, and I will use this in the winter months just to kind of lighten up a little bit if a shade is too dark in the neutral family so there you have it these are my empties these are the things that I've been using I have purchased these not once but oftentimes twice if not three four times so these are basically staples in my arsenal and I wanted to share them with you because some of these products I have mentioned but many I have not and I feel if they're working for me well hey they may be working for you and what I love about all of this is the price point is very reasonable nothing is through the roof um, we're not spending crazy money here and I don't feel that you have to to get results in a lot of different areas so anyway happy to share my empties with you and what's been working and um, it's time to go to the store and replenish let me know what your empties are things that you have used up and that you are going to repurchase again which tells me that they're effective you like them and they're working for you share them with my ladies here uh, because everybody appreciates the contribution that you have to offer and somebody might uh, pick up a tip or two from you from me from from all of us uh, anyway I hope you're having a great week as we launch into fall we're all adjusting now to back to school schedules I'm a little sleepy I did use my um, coffee bean cream eye cream this morning because yes there were some puffies right under here um, I hope the season's getting off to a really good start looking forward to providing some fall content for you here on this channel thank you as always for following me I appreciate it I've got a new website Dominique Socks at TV I've got this new Facebook page it's it's everything's getting a refresher long overdue go out be bold and be blessed with all that you have follow me on social media and I look forward to seeing you next Thursday at 1 bye bye